Well, good morning, folks. Papa Ron here. Um, Bulldog Rod is once again missing in action. Couldn't get a hold of him this morning. I don't know what he's got going, but he has a lot of other hobbies that take his interest. So with that, though, we had some things that we wanted to kind of go over, and we thought uh, we'd still do a video, even without my brother Rod. So with that, we'll get started. A couple quick news articles. Um... Here from InvestorIdeas.com, uh, it's kind of cool. First Bitcoin real estate purchased recorded in Texas. It's a new housing development. They build homes. They offer those for Bitcoin. And uh, sure enough, somebody came up and paid the entire home off they're purchasing in Bitcoin. Kind of a cool idea. It just shows you that things are still progressing in the industry. Um, and here's something interesting. Well, not interesting. We've reported on this earlier, um, but they're starting to talk about it more and more on the press, it seems. The Bitcoin might face another split as the scaling debate still presses onward. Um, and they're, they're talking about this probably sometime in November. So we'll definitely keep you informed once we get a little bit more information on it, but people are talking about it and uh, we'll have this article in the description box so if you want to review it you can do that and the reason we uh, kind of got on this morning or I did is there's something that started back in 013 at least the idea was kind of conceptualized and and thought about and it's kind of made its appearance now and that's atomic exchanging a peer-to-peer -peer type way to exchange cryptocurrency. Now, as far as I know, I don't think there's any fiat involved in it, but if I wanted to change my Bitcoin to, let's say, Litecoin, um, that can be done through smart contracts now. At least that's they're about ready to put this into beta testing. And so it would be the need without exchanges like Polynex, or uh, even Shapeshift that exchange coin for coin. You can actually do this yourself now. Probably no fees involved, I guess. Um, so that's kind of what we talk about. But before we get into that, one of the one of the uh, main players of this game is, and I think it's Decret, Decreed, Decreed, um, cryptocurrency. And, and I got on and did some research on this, and they're, they're a pretty solid platform. They've got a lot going for themselves. They actually say that this is the cryptocurrency for the people. Um, one comment I read by somebody said, this is what Bitcoin should have been, that, that this is for the people um, to be used daily and stuff. And... Um, it's even owned and governed by the people that have invested in um, Decreed. So they have a pretty good platform as far as um, they have proof of work. You can, you can actually mine these coins. They have a proof of stake program. And then they have a voting thing where you can actually vote on these topics that come before the uh, community. And you can get these tally vote things that you get within your wallet and place your yay or nay on, on so helping to make decisions. So as part of the community, you're involved with that. Um, I'm not going to do a lot of time on this coin or token. You can uh, look them up, but I think they got a pretty good solid program. But I wanted to get into this... Um, article that came out uh, and this here is in NASDAQ Decreed adds atomic swap support for exchange free cryptocurrency trading and this is the article that we're kind of talking about where you can actually peer to peer trade coin to coin you can go over two different blockchains to accomplish this um, and it might cut some of this exchange out and some of those fees. Matter of fact, yesterday I was overlooking at well, today I was looking at Bitcoin Talk, and here Charlie Lee, um, 
and, and this this program includes Decreed, Litecoin, and Bitcoin. These are the three ones, and they've instituted in with that, or they've using Lightning Network to help get this done. But Charlie Lee says that yesterday he did an on-chain atomic swap of Litecoin into Decreed, and it went flawlessly. Uh, this was in uh, yesterday. No, this is today. He actually posted that today. So, um, again, those are the three major coins playing with this. I guess the developers in Decreed, the reason they're involved is is this is kind of, I don't want to say it's fully their baby, but they kind of had the idea and the developers kind of made progress towards it. They involved Bitcoin, Litecoin with Charlie Lee, and they say a big instrumental part of it is that Lightning Network. Um, again, this article will be down in the description box, so you can kind of check that out. It sounds pretty cool. I mean, things are progressing to a different stage. I mean, I remember when we did a thing on Ripple and their interledger thing where you could send any currency, crypto, fiat, uh, anything like that, and, and they had their experiment where it crossed over seven blockchains and came out the other side. So if you wanted to send Bitcoin and come out US dollars, that inner ledger with Ripple accomplished that. We thought that was a pretty big deal. This, with this atomic swapping, is very cool. Um, and I don't know, sooner or later they might institute it where you can do it for fiat also. I don't know why you couldn't as long as you had the smart contract stating that and you could pull those coins or that fiat currency out of a bank or something. Um, so it's all based on smart contracts, lightning network, and I think they'll have this instituted very soon as far as a beta and, and, and getting it going. So to me that was pretty cool, it's big news. Um, as far as um, Decree, they have a, a digest here, and this this is uh, actually the 14th, so it's about six days old, but demand for Decree is on the rise, they say, and through their proof of stake, and, and it's a pretty good report. This is just another thing that backs up that Decree is a pretty solid, ongoing platform. Um, to give out information like this to your community and stuff. I, I like that. I think that's very f aggressive and uh, you know, and you're, you have your footing on solid, a solid foundation. So anyway, folks, oh, I didn't even show you that. I'm sorry. Here's, here's that. It's called the uh, Decreed Digest. Um, their price is rising. They give a pretty good report here and I guess they put these out periodically for all the community and members to see and uh, keep them informed on things and uh, you can always go like I say over to Bitcoin talk under decreed and read more about this stuff there's quite a bit of an excitement and buzz going on right now same with on reddit so folks thanks uh, that's kind of breaking news I think it's very cool and Rod's gonna be upset he's not here to share it with you so thank you and I'll leave you with his blessing God bless